Hello, and welcome back to A Keeper of the Prophecies. Uh, this is the fourth? Fifth? Not sure, fifth mission, I think. Uh, an Oracle of the Prophets. We've gone through a precursor portal and ended up in this strange alien world. Uh, I won't go out there, the trigger's trapped. Uh, we'll go back there soon. Uh, and obviously if you saw the previous episode, you'll, you've seen it already. Time has stopped, so the poison is no longer active, but we still need to find an antidote somewhere. And at the moment, we're in this chamber where the keepers have been before. These are four transporter devices, I believe, to take us back to the surface, or possibly back to the other chambers. I'm not sure which. I'm going to take a hard save before I carry on. And let's try the red one. Yeah, it's back to the surface. Right now, if I remember correctly... Ooh, there's somebody angry up there. Let's, let's not stay there, though. Uh, the actual globes that took us on the inside... Well, the one I found before was right near the edge. Oh, here's a white one. Ah! Oh, well, that's no good. Did I have a good quick save? Quick save? No, I didn't have a good quick save. Let's reload that one. Oh, let's go back through here. First things first. Make sure Angry Man up there isn't going to see us. Second things. See if I can find a way down that doesn't involve falling to my death. Let's try. Ugh. Alright. Uh, so far, so good. Oh, here we are. Alright, well this will take us to the white chambers, which we haven't been to before. So, in the red globe chamber, I still I still want to go back there. Firstly, we have to do the red globe thing, because I didn't manage to get that done. Because of all the monsters around there. But, um... Not that one, this one. Nope, this one. Mm, nope, this one. Got too many of these. Uh, no. How about this? I've got too many others. Here we are. Uh, I crawl behind a particle wall of the red globe chamber. If I'm later found, whether dead or alive, I plead with the my brothers, show me final mercy and cast my broken body, living or dead, into the glowing abyss of this place. I assume that means into the lava pit. So I want to do that. It sounds like a bonus objective. Maybe it's not. I don't know. Maybe it's just colour. Someone writing that they hope to be. Uh, hope that way they can escape. But regardless. I do want to do that in the red globe chamber. But for now, we're in the white globe chamber. God, too much light. I see some loot. I see another fire thingy. Does someone have a fire crystal in it? Doesn't appear to. So apparently the red club chamber and the blue club chamber actually interconnect because I found doors between them. I wonder if any of the others do. Well, here's another here's a way down. Let's not go there yet. What's that? Uh, another piece of paper. Let's go find out what it says. Oh, hello. Somebody stuck behind a wall in the, uh, in here too. Brothers and sisters, of the four evil entities we found at this highest cavern level, I have managed to kill two, if that is the right word for this. Death has little meaning in this place. Two others I have found trapped behind magic walls, these having fallen into a harmless trance. Take a moment to closely study this enemy. The evil is clear, and it should be a warning to avoid these entities to the greatest extent. Kelvin. Loot. Yeah, he's, uh... Doesn't look very friendly. Alright, since I started going around the left hand wall, I guess I kind of continue 
going around the left hand wall. I'm going to get completely lost otherwise. Yeah, this takes us to the green chamber. So I say red and blue interconnect and white and green interconnect. Alright, well, let's not go to green just yet. Let's finish exploring white first. Uh, oh, Judy, I bet you didn't expect this this much adventure. Going to an alien planet and all. Oh, planety thing. Where are we? That's what I was looking for. So, uh, passage to the green chamber is in the south. There's also another one here. Okay. So I guess that just gives me a choice which way I want to go. Whoa. Don't shoot at me. He doesn't look like a hammerite, does he? He looks more like a uh, what is uh, from a space marine or something, you know? <sighs> oh shite! How did that trigger? I wasn't in front of it. anywhere near where it hit either. That was a big explosion right here. So it's okay, this is supposed to be where I fell in? No. Not too far. Do I have another healing potion? No, I don't. I guess holy water must work on some of these baddies because otherwise why would I have holy water? Uh, let's go down. I'm going to leave the green place to itself. So there's no baddies down here. Or at least nowhere down here that are going to see me right away. I want to shoot that squid. God, this light. I want to shoot that squid when he's near that guy so I can get two with one. kill me. He didn't even hit me, thankfully. But mostly by fluke. Okay, I see another fire arrow. Let's get it. We're running low on them, and they're handy. Now, do these things fire off just at some period of time after I take the fire arrow, or what? Or is it... Or is it actually standing in front of them, does it? I don't know. don't really want to know. I mean, I would like to know, but I don't want to experiment to find out. Eight fire arrows, that's actually not bad. Well, let's do the experiment, I've just saved. Whoops, I didn't want to fall down. Okay. Yeah, I see another jellyfish. Let's go sit in the dark somewhere. Very dark. They'll definitely see me if I take out my bow. He's 
show me. Do I fly arrow him? What do I wait for him to give up? Come on, go stand near the jellyfish. Near the jellyfish. Yeah. I'm missing. This is not working. It's a bad, bad idea. Nope, I don't. You're too fast. And too. You hit too hard. That didn't work. Alright. Can I take this shot from here? Well, it was enraged already, so it didn't kill it. Lighting is really weird too. Sometimes I'm invisible with the bow, sometimes I'm visible. Oddly enough, despite the low gravity of the place, it does seem that arrows have normal gravity. But I should really wait till they come down, because. Uh What? What happened there? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna wait till they calm down, which is gonna be a bit boring. On the other hand, I could just go downstairs. There's nothing else for me here. Aha, you won't find me here. All I need to do is get the globe, right? Which is there. I do need to watch out for those flying dudes because they do come through this door. There's probably a big monster man in through there as well. In addition to the squids. Can't tell which way the squids are looking, that's the one problem. I missed that shot. Okay, so I need to. Maybe I need to prop those things around the outside of the pit in order to get access. I don't know. I need somehow, some way. There's access actuators I need. Somehow. Uh, maybe I can hide behind that pillar. Is it dark here? It is dark here. I can't really hide here well with these squids flying around. They will see me and shoot at me. I don't really have the health to uh, manage to deal with that. So I'm going to have to try to take them out first. Wait till one comes round and then snipe it. Where are they? So it's the downside of hiding here, there it is. I'm just gonna get the other one interested, no doubt. It's probably going to get everybody interested, actually. It's going to be bad. Big mouth man, certainly interested. Uh, 
there is another squid there. Oh, almost invisible. Yeah, they're both angry right now. I have to wait till they calm down. Maybe I have to touch all of those crystals to get at the globe. I didn't manage to get at the red globe properly. I'm less worried about... Exp oh, I've got to find the antidote, right? Getting out of here doesn't help me if I don't have the antidote. In fact, it's probably bad, because then I'll just die from the poison. Unless the antidote is on the escape route from this place. Not sure why we'll be in these chasm, in these chambers, because... What's in these chambers? Besides... Dead, and maybe some wandering hammerites. I've got an objective not to harm any hammerite explorers, so... That suggests there's still some alive somewhere around. I can't see well enough. Where's the squid? He's not there. Do these things activate? Apparently not. Alright, those things don't prop. How do I... What is the access actuator? Also, what's that glowy thing? Oh, it's a squid. It's become visible again. Oh, there's two of them. Right. Invisible one and a visible one. Just for my luck. If you're coming over here, maybe you can see what lies behind this door. It looks like another scrap of paper. There's definitely another eye. What does this one say? Brothers and sisters, the lava bits prevent me from gaining access to the floating globes. But I did discover an actuator on the opposite wall from one entry point. And this switch should send a temporary magic floor over the lava pit. The evil entities were so thick that I could not test my feet upon this magic surface. But it appears to be the only hope to reach the centre of each globe, as this is where one must touch it. Okay, so that... Magic floor... I did manage to reach the magic floor of the red one, or activate the magic floor of the red one somehow. Uh, because I walked across it, but it was incredibly slippery. Uh, it was very slippery, and not actually... Um, not actually uh, helpful to me in reaching the globe, because I couldn't jump. I mean, that looks like the temporary magic floor is there already, right? At least it's... Oh, there we are. Alright. Uh, I did it. What now? These things are firing gas everywhere. Where to from here? Is he coming for me? No, he's just searching. I heard one of them explode. They must have got hit by one of the, by a projectile from something. I think I got, I think I activated that white one. It went, it made a noise. You do not but it hasn't, it hasn't changed its appearance, which is unfortunate. Some feedback would be nice. Do I just run? I just run.
Maybe if I flip the actuator again, that'll, uh... Whoops. He's off me. I need to find a way down. Help me. Oh, well, here's the way out. Somebody's shooting at me. Goodbye. Shit. I ran into something. Goodbye. Come on, jump down, mate. Fall down. Don't mind me. <sighs> Alright, we are back in the center room again. So this is easier than I first anticipated when I was uh, trying to find the... Um, the things. When I was making my way through the red one, because I, I had no idea what I was doing or where I was going, but now I do. Wait. All oh, right, so I need to get all four globes in order to touch this star, okay. And then... So I can now activate these white ones, but not the others. All right. Well, that white one is bleeding blue blood. Or dripping... It's clearly, act clearly active in some alien fashion. Uh, so I need back to the northwest side of the chamber then. Over here is not. Yes, that's where I need to go. And we'll take another uh, one of these up and go back to the surface again. So we went in the red one that time and it took us near the white uh, entry point. Don't forget the traps. <laughs> uh, right, hard save. So we went in the red. Let's just keep going around the walls, right? Let's go for the blue one now. Whoops. Shite. Let's try that again. Oh, what happens if I fall into space? Do I just... Yeah, I just die suddenly. Let's try that again, but a bit more slowly. I noticed two green entry points down there. Yeah, no. Somehow, for some reason, I fall off that ledge at high speed, which is not what I wanted to do. this way. There's no baddies around here. I'm crouching and walking slowly because that makes it a little more controllable to go down slopes sometimes. So there were two green globes down this way. Careful! No, 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 no! Yeah. The uh, surface here is area is more uh, frustrating. A lot more frustrating. Let's try this one. Looks perhaps easier to get to. Yeah. Yes. All right. All right, quick save. We're in the green globe chamber now. We should get another fire arrow here. And look at that column of lava there, that's interesting. That's new as well. See, there he showed at me again, and I don't know why. Don't know why or when those eyes shoot, or how often. Maybe they only ever shoot once. Maybe you can trigger them and then, then they're safe. Whoa, there's, there's magic missiles everywhere here. 
That's a uh, dangerous looking column of lava too. That's just my theory. No, oh, running in front of it didn't set off. I have no idea what sets these eyes off. No idea at all. All right, so we're gonna find our way through green. We've gotta to descend two levels. This just goes round, right? Just turns up. No, this, that's an eye I haven't been to before. It's still got a fire crystal in it. Alright, let's just all back to the white area, which I've been to. Uh, so we need to find the green globe, so we need to go down a couple of levels here, and it shouldn't be too hard to find. Here's a way down. Here's another eye. And there's something over there to check out. See that that something set him off there, but I don't know why. Ah! Something set him off there, but I don't know what. Set him off twice. Oh, well I hadn't taken the fire crystal when I saved, okay. Is it taking the fire taking the fire crystal sometimes sets him off maybe? I don't know. I only fired twice, not just once. Oh, it's a leg bone, how nice. But also a diamond. That's cool, that's cool. So that's another way back to the white area, so I don't want to go there. Let's stay in green just here. And I guess we go down now. Down to the next floor. So I guess it could potentially rope arrow to get back up to other floors, but it's possibly not needed. Maybe it uh, only sets off if it sees us. Oh, I don't know what sets them off. Oh, another note. Oh, and a baddie. Going our way. So we're gonna find some darkness. Only the many, surely. This is a place most damned. Not one inhabitant sleeps except for the two I found trapped behind magic walls. Yet I must sleep. Upon awakening, I have just noticed poor Hastens urgently passing my way, but I could not call to him for fear of alerting the evil ones. Moments later, I heard hideous screams filling the caverns ahead. And so, by my accounting, our entire party is now lost, save for myself and our beloved master Arcelius, and his fate remains unknown to me. Ooh. So he's transparent, big monster. Let's stay away from him. These guys will die to a single fire arrow if it hits them. Uh, 
know, this is a bad idea. Did I mention it was a bad idea? Oh, this is also a bad idea. Goodbye! Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> Let's try it again. So, Big Bad wants to there. I want to keep out of his way, but I kind of want to go beyond him. Maybe I can crawl behind him. Safely. Oh, that's just a white chamber. I don't want to go there after all. Another problem with these enemies is I can't read their sounds. Searching and nuts. Well, especially them. And when they're just idle. Ah! Well, that's gonna get some attention, isn't it? Of the wrong kind. Shit! Yeah, you're mad, I guess. I wonder why. I see a fire arrow here, I want. Oh, and he lost me. Okay. Uh, okay then, I guess I go down. No point staying here with them all angry at me. It's not very dark. I'd like it to be much darker. I don't want my flesh to welcome you. Alright, see the switch. Let's go flip it and get out of here. Your flesh will welcome us. My flesh won't. Oh! <laughs> I thought I was supposed to activate a, uh, a floor. Well, apparently not, alright. Dark patch here. I can wait for them to cool down. Uh, so, perhaps the magic floor takes a little while to appear. A little less haste, perhaps. Do nothing of the sort. Shit, everybody's on my case. Not I don't welcome you either. 
that make a floor happen? I don't see a magic floor. Why don't I see a magic floor? I should see a magic floor. Oh, there we are. Magic floor is happening. Alright, now I need to find a way down, which is not this way. Maybe this way. Where's the way out? Quick. Yeah, that's the way out. Good. Oh, hello. I see you there. I don't care. Right, so there's big ones and small ones of those that shoot different projectiles. That's interesting, but not very necessary to know. <sighs> okay. So we've done green, we've done white. Let's go back to the northwest. Let's go and do red again. Since I went past before, I didn't realize I had to frob the thing in the middle. Careful, careful. Let's not be too hasty with our descent here. Careful. Ouch. I didn't really want to do that. Well, unless I fall in the lava, I'm going to live with it. Straps, straps. Yeah, don't shoot me. All right, so we're into red, we're into blue. Another hard save. Let's go to white. I would like to get another. I would really like to get another healing potion. Five hit points. It's not really enough to handle accidents when you're uh, in this kind of. Highly accident-prone environment. I think there's a red portal down here, which will take us back to the red globe chamber where we started. I thought I saw a red glow. Could be mistaken. Yep. Alright. So I explored this one pretty thoroughly before, so I really just need to find a way down and uh, make my way... Here we are, here's a way down. Oh, this is one of the other notes I left. I kind of left that one as a marker. Alright, I read this one. Yeah, I'll take it. It's evidence of something. Uh, so let's just go and do the globe. I don't know about finding this guy. I don't think that's relevant. I just want to get out of here. And I hope the antidote is on the way out and not in this horrible place. But this is all about who's going to be judged worthy, right? According to... According to Kelvin's diary. Need to find another way down. Here's the big guy I killed. It took way too many arrows. Uh, five arrows. I've got 15 now. I'm actually pretty well set if I do get into... Fights, but I don't want to get into fights. I want to avoid fights. Uh, hello there. Yeah, I didn't. Don't think this is a good idea, you know? not go down this hole. If there's a monster right in front of us, that's a really bad idea. Let's try and find another way down. 
better be another way down. Hello, friend. Okay, just kidding me. I'm sure there is another way down. I just have to find it. Like this one. Let's hope this one's a little better. In fact, it looks like I can fall right into a shadow. How nice. Definitely better than falling right into uh, the light. Is there a fire crystal there? There is indeed. Okay. Let's go get it. Okay, okay, so we've got a big guy, we've got a fire elemental or two. No squids that I can see. Fire elemental is at least easy to deal with. Let me take one water arrow. Where's the actuator? I can't see it. It's on one of the walls. Oh, there it is. Big guy's not looking our way. Fire elementals the other side, and we're kind of in the darkness. He hopefully won't see us. And let's get out of here. No, we don't want you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Sorry to leave you. All right, uh, that's three done. Back to the northwest. All we're gonna do now is the blue chamber. And then we uh, should be ready to get out of here, I guess. Whew. Both times the charm. Yeah, I'm kind of glad they avoided the rule of three at least and went for, even if they did go for rule of four. Uh, this way is the safest way down. So let's quick save, I haven't done that for a bit. Right, uh, go through the last portal in here. Dodge the uh, traps. Make another hard save. How many for time? 43 minutes. So we're doing much quicker this time than the very first uh, episode. So hopefully down here is a blue portal somewhere. Down here somewhere. If uh, things are happening in the same order. Indeed, there's a blue portal. Can I get to it without falling off the edge? Another good question. Now there's two of them. I guess it leads to different places. All right. Let go. So I've actually explored some of this blue area as well because they're connected to the red. So let's find a way down. I do like they put those things on the roof most of the time so we can actually see there's a way down. They're probably also uh, capable of taking roof arrows as well, I guess. Perhaps. Alright, how about being here? No. Maybe. Once again, all I need is another way down. And we can go. Uh, I've been here, there's, there's body parts. Those body parts don't just appear. Here's a way down. I don't know if it's a good one. We'll find out.
Well, that's not a terrible one. We have a squid. We've got another fire arrow if I want it. Good shot. That might draw some attention, but hopefully not over here. It is just as well they didn't adjust the gravity on the uh, arrows to match the general world of gravity because I would have been screwed. Is, there, is there no one else around? No one heard that? I'm not going to complain too much if this one's easy. There's, there's a few people around. Oh, there's another squid wandering around. Wandering around. Wandering around. Oh, he is uh, upset. Okay. Um, should I just run for it again? Seems a good plan, generally. Let's just run for it again. Let's find the switch. Which is there. Run around a bit. Oh, he hasn't even seen me. He's still ex investigating the explosion, I guess. Oh, we've got the floor. No, I didn't, I didn't manage to prop it. And now we find the way out. Whoa, whoa, this is dangerous. There's some firing fire everywhere. Yikes. I don't want to be around this. Sorry, mate. Don't want to... No time to talk. I'm looking for the way out. Is it this way? It is this way. Hello, mate. Goodbye. Pretty lucky none of those uh, big fire explosions got me. Ooh, careful. Whew. All right, we have robbed all four globes, which means we can now start touching the stars. The four stars on each level, and once we've done that, then a way out is supposed to open. That's what uh, Kelvin's journal said, so he better be right. Well, there goes the force field. Okay, we've touched green. I don't know what sits off this eye, but I'm just going to run for it. I hope I don't. Uh, one down, three to go. Since I've got rid of the fire and elementals that were patrolling this area, this is actually fairly safe as well. There's nothing down there. Oh, where's the next one? Oh wait, that's spawned some baddies. That's not fair. It's not fair at all. There's a squid there. It's not fair. Why does that one not work? Do I have to do them in order? Alright, I'll go try the other ones then. Trying to stay out of the way of the mad squid. Spot. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Careful there, guy. Spawning new enemies <laughs> is a little nasty. You know? A little unfair. I don't, I don't really like that. But okay, whatever. Uh, down here. Yep. Blue. And we got red. I'm gonna try back going back to white again. Okay, that's two.
White is over this way. No, red is over this way. Where's the... Further around. Down there. Okay. Don't know where Squidman is. But, uh, I'm also quite happy with not knowing. Oh yeah, the white one is the only one with all four uh, globes around it. So I guess it's... I guess it makes... Three out of four. I guess the white one makes that big center white globe active or something. Can I get up there? No, it's too steep. me. I was just leaving. I'm auto saving pretty often in case I just fall off an edge stupidly because that can happen. Uh, was this the way to white? Uh, was this green? I can't remember. Oh, it looks white. Okay. Now, red, yay, and blue. Objective complete, uh, access the heart of fire. I don't know how to access the heart of fire, does that? Do not let fear control your path. Oh. This is how I access the heart of fire. By not letting fear control my path. Leap of faith. Well, hard save. This is the way to go, I'm sure, but it's, uh, you know, it's a test. It's not a star, it's a globey thing in the sky. Where is this taking me? Down over the edge? Up and underneath the underside or something? I don't know. Presumably somewhere I couldn't have got to before. Oh, just a big globe thing. So taking me to that. I guess this is the destination. A mini Jupiter. the other side. Oh, there's another one. I 
guess we're going to be like the uh, Star Movie in 2001. Oh, I like that the stars are actually moving past me. That's very neat. Here we go. planet here. The wildly spinning planety thing. Looks like I could just pick it up. Now, what if the antidote was back there in the caves and I missed it? That would be very entertaining. this place about me? my future. There is no past or future here. There is only the past and if you live on the other side of time where you make your choices. So if I stay here I won't die? Is that the solution? That is not allowed. You must leave to seek your destiny. 
you may not remain in this place. My destiny lately is to die. And I came here looking for an antidote. Your destiny is to live. You are a keeper. All we cling to you. The antidote lies in reversing the order. And when you are successful, then all will be as it should have been. Okay, well, I wasn't expecting a giant disembodied pair of cat's eyes. The antidote lies in reversing the order. Leave through the portal. Well, goodbye, weird space place. Alright, um, 2 hours, 3 minutes, 48 seconds, we missed 100 loot, so it must be a diamond or a couple of nuggets we missed somewhere, that's fine. Damage dealt 255, that's definitely a record for me on this uh, campaign so far. No secrets to miss. Okay, well I think this is a really good place to end the episode, so I will do that.